Hello YouTube, how's everyone doing? It's Professional here. Welcome back to my playthrough of the Godfather the Dawn's Edition. We're gonna do a lot today. Uh, we're gonna help! take over Brooklyn. We're gonna clear out the Barzini Warehouse and the Tatalia Warehouse and then complete those hits and story missions. Hope you guys enjoy this part. And again, if you guys do enjoy this series, please do drop a like because it does help the series out a lot. So, let's call in that um, uh, Corleone hit squad now. Whoa, sorry, excuse me. Okay, we've got a big squad with us now. Let's take over the Barzini Nail warehouse. It. Let's move in for the kill. Ah, we're on the same team, asshole. I think this is the warehouse that the Tatalias control in the story also. But now the Barzinis control it. Um... Yeah, pretty stupid to take behind cover you. behind the barrel, idiot. Okay, Barzini's are the toughest family size of Corleones. I'm taking a breather, boss. I can't get a good shot! What's the plan? Hmm. Looks like I might have taken a wrong path here. the execution there um okay this part is not gonna be easy I can't get a good shot oh I'm hit Yeah, this guy's in some good cover here. Take this! Be shot! Let him go! Oh. Wish my guys would move up a little bit on them. I don't know what that guy is doing up there. Get behind me, boss! I love the soundtrack in this game. Boss, stay down! Hey, you wanna hit up a shopkeeper? Well, Ready we're hitting up a warehouse right now. Oh, looks like warehouse door opened. Got plenty of ammo for the Tommy gun now, too. Magnum. Shot! It's gonna take more than that to stop us! Give me- Oh, reinforcements are coming in. Okay. Got it. Ah. Oh. 
I'm hit! Somebody nail this bastard! Okay, is that it? If you want to keep running your business, you got to run it for the Corleones. You ain't got the balls to run this business. I just killed all of the guys protecting your place. You got to be kidding me. Come on now. Don't waste I surrender. Ha! Tell me now. What's your answer? Okay, it's yours. I just hope you know what you're getting into. Whoa. So it's a fu- Ha! Ha! There grab this plenty guy. of respect. You ain't gonna scream, are you? Boss, grab this guy. Will somebody just oh. Don't do anything sneak. Ah! No one punches a Corleone. That ain't nothing. Think you can take on the both of us? No one punches a Corleone. Uh, yeah, I guess no one punches a Corleone. There we go. Okay, that warehouse is the most profitable warehouse that we have seized already. Okay, um, well, what the? There's still a few of them left? We got him! <laughs> oh. Ow. There we go. The Barzinis have officially been kicked out of Brooklyn, and so have the Strachis. The Natalias are the only ones that are left. The Cuneos aren't here either. Okay, let's talk to the FBI agent here. You've been stirring up some real heat, Mac. My services won't be cheap. Yeah. Go after some other family. The Corleones ain't bothering anyone. No problem. They cut it coming anyway, right? And that's the thing is, you, you gotta bribe the FBI agents and the police chiefs because it just makes it so much easier. A lot of people don't want to spend money on that, but trust me, it just makes it so much easier. And it's, it's also an investment because when you think about it, when the police, are, you, you aren't dealing with the police, you can focus on other matters. So you can deal with the other families, take over other businesses, and make more money in the meantime. Okay, which one? This one's the least damaged. Okay. Oh! No! Okay, let's see skills and upgrades. Um... Upgrade this. We want our crew to do more damage over time. That'll help a lot. Okay. Okay, we got... We got the crew here with us too okay let's take this place now this is the Tatalia warehouse in Brooklyn this is gonna be a lot easier the Tat Tatalias are the easiest family to deal with payday nice 21,000 and I'm gonna buy some of the upgraded weapons on this part too ah, they shot me. I'm hit boss. wow they're doing work Nice. Okay. Ah, they shot me. Take uh, uh, him. Uh, uh. They're on. Take cover. You want to pick up the health when enemies aren't shooting at you, um, because you see that bar, your health will come back as long as um, you don't get shot in, in that time. Get behind me, boss! Man, this Corleone hit squad helps out so much. Oh, a shovel? That's a weird melee weapon to have, but I'll take it. Okay. 
I do love the soundtrack. All the trumpets. Okay, guys, come on, back up. Don't get, don't be near the explosion. Come on, I promise not to hit too hard. Look out behind you. Oh. I'm hit. Oh. Look out behind you. He's hit! I'll kill you! Ah! Clear. You're out of your league, Mac. Don Corleone wants to buy you out. Is this enough for your retirement? That seems like a fair price. You got yourself a deal. There we go. So we bought that guy out. Oh, we've also leveled up. Nice. Uh, skills and upgrades. We're going to upgrade the 40% um, crew health. And then eventually 20% more crew damage. That'll help a lot. So like when you get some good guys upgraded, that's going to be like an investment to really help you out. So there we go. We now have pretty much complete control of Brooklyn. Um, uh, the only thing we don't have control of is the Tatalia compound, but I'm going to leave all the compounds for the end. So when I finish the main story, we'll go after all the family compounds in one big video. But like I know a lot of people, when they do playthroughs, the Godfather, they just do the story. But I figured that I would do the um, uh, a lot of the um, uh, the com uh, the compound takeovers, the um, uh, racket takeovers, the warehouse takeovers, because that's like an essential part of the game, and it's what most people are gonna be doing while they play through the game, right? Well, don't gotta worry about those guys anymore. Place is taken over, anyways. So I'll show you guys another trick to end the mob war. The mob wars are really annoying because the hit squads will just constantly keep coming after you and it can make playing very difficult. So there's two ways to end the mob war. Bribe the FBI agent or you can blow up um, a, a business of that family. It doesn't even have to be a specific business. So right here we got, um, looks like a Tatalia club. What the hell? Yo, come here. Ah, ah! Okay, time to get out of here. Police! We've won a war against the Tatalias. So that's it. Um, unfortunate you don't see the building on fire. That's the that's the bad thing. But now the, the unfortunate thing is that when you do um uh don't leave me here. When you do that though, the police are now gonna be on you. So you see that? So there's that's the downside of it. You gotta have a bomb ready and um uh, the police will come after you, so that's the frustrating thing to get your ugly mug out of my face. We appreciate any assistance you can give. Understand? It's a deal, but don't let things get too out of control. Capish? Okay. I won't let things get too out of control. Your ah, my face! No one What's punches next? a Corleone! for my mother. Get by I me, never miss twice. Oh. I'll get you back for that. Do it. Get your m- ah, oh. <laughs> Don't mess with me, man. This is a tough neighborhood. You could use some protection. Go find another sucker. I don't like your kind. Don't make the boss angry now, understand? This is gonna hurt. Weak spot right there. This is only gonna get worse, buddy. You wanna end up six feet under? Then pay me what I want. You don't have to worry about me. I'll pay. Okay, let's see. Is there anything back here? No, there isn't. Okay. Here, boss. Don't let things get out of hand. 
So a lot of you guys have been asking me to buy the black market weapon, so I was saving up for the Tommy gun, because that's the one that I wanted upgraded. Nice, huh? I'll give you a Dillinger. good price. Okay. You got yourself a deal, Mac. Now, Dillinger is a reference to the, um... To the, that's... Oh, You'll who am I getting get shot at by right now? They're back All the Barzinis. Take cover! Dillinger is a reference to, to um, I think his first name was John, John Dillinger. He was, um, uh, he was a, a bank robber in, during the Great Depression. And so he robbed a lot of banks with automatic weapons especially. And so I think that's why it's called the Dillinger in reference to him. Hey, Doc, my neck's been killing me. Think you can give me something for the pain? Not without a prescription, sir. You should know that. That's not what I've heard. Word on the street is that this is the place to go for whatever pills you like. What? That's ridiculous. I run a respectable clinic. Oh, really? In that case, you won't mind if I take a look around back. Oh. Yeah. Oh. Ah. How? What do we got here? Curious what's in that safe. What's the doctor hiding? Okay. You now have a forged heroin prescription belonging to the police chief of Brooklyn. Confront the police the chief break. at um, uh, Michelangelo's down. barber shop in Brooklyn. So a lot of drugs were actually legal back then. I'm not sure about heroin, but um, for instance, Coca-Cola actually had small amounts of cocaine in it. That's what a lot of people don't um, don't know. That's why it was called Coca-Cola. Um, so that's actually um, that that is actually true. Um, that still surprises a lot of people to this day. But this is what you can use as blackmail, so you can use this as blackmail against certain targets, like, um, uh, police chiefs. I don't know about the FBI agents, but I know the police chiefs it'll work on. Fresh produce! Get your fresh produce! You want a I'll chief? Be here if you need Had any back okay, pain boss. recently? Need something to fix you up? What are you talking about? No one talks to me like that! Quiet! I know where you've been getting your junk. Morphine? Heroin? These are some serious drugs, Chief. It'd be a shame if the Commissioner had to learn about your dirty habit. You wouldn't. I'd be ruined. Look, keep, it, keep this between us, and uh, I'll make it free if you ever need some police protection in Brooklyn. I just don't tell anyone. So there we go. Now we have a lot of more per police protection in Brooklyn. Sorry, Mac. Private vault. You need a key to get in here. Got it. Right here. Now, if you don't mind... Sorry, sir. No problem. Right this way. So, remember that key that we had gotten, um, uh... You found a new key. Wow. 50 grand. That's how much we got from that, um, uh... That safe. But, um, uh, remember the burning build business? But... That's... I think we'll take an even bigger deposit out of the bank, though. Please. You actually have to move the controller like this when you want to snap their neck. So that's, um... Okay. Let's see what's in this vault here, then. Fire in the hole. Definitely gonna cause the cops to show up now. Another eight grand, okay. Boss, I'm in! Hey, yep. shut up! Get ready to take Okay, let's get out of here. Oh my god! He shot me! Oh! 
I think we just made a withdrawal. I'll stay right here, boss. Keep an eye on things. Great amount of cash that we got. We can dismiss the Corleone hit squad. We don't need them for now. You really gonna send us home? Yeah, you're out. I can handle this by myself. This is kind of weird because um, uh, the thing is, uh, Aldo is a soldier in the family, and Aldo, a, a soldier, could probably ha would probably have an associate like this guy with him, because the guy that's protecting us, our bodyguard, he's an associate. He's not a soldier. Um, uh, an associate is with the mafia, but they aren't an official member of the mafia. If that makes sense, they're not a made man. A soldier is. Um, and so a soldier wouldn't have like a whole crew with him like that unless he hired a bunch of associates I guess maybe then but um a typic typically a capo regime would have a crew with him like that Whoa, whoa, what's going on here? Great, it's a Kunio attack He's going down. Now uh, I thought I started another mob war for a second. Got it! Open fire! Okay, boys. Son of a bitch! Go uh, uh, Help me! Uh, Nailed him! Let's move in for the kill! Okay, more of them are coming in. He's Blake! Move in! Uh, don't think you can uh, got it. open fire. Ooh, there we go. That Dillinger is helping out a lot. Okay, let's go to the basement, because usually the basement is just stocked with supplies. Oh yeah, look at that. A lot of ammo there. Hey, kid, listen up. We need some work done. Capiche? I'm interested. What are you thinking? Salazzo's dead. Bruno Tattaglia's dead. But still, the, the Tattaglia's, they keep attacking us. Shooting on sight. They must, uh, I don't know, have some secrets they're keeping from us. Whoever the hell it is, they must want it really bad. What does the family want me to do now? Meet me by, uh... Lucy Mancini's apartment tomorrow. You probably see some of my crew hanging around here. I got a little business, you know? Okay. Meet Sonny over um, at Lucy's place in Midtown, okay? Afraid of a little work? Anything for the Don. What does he need? To destroy your family, you gotta infiltrate their compound. They're all well protected, so you'll need to be heavily armed. Shoot your way through the roadblocks. Get inside their stronghold and plant the bomb in both buildings to torch the place. Oh, well, When's this... Michael coming back from Sicily? Sonny's right. Not the until this war settles down. Are getting more Tattalia's are pissed. The Cunios are getting cocky. Like someone's Michael pulling make an easy strings, target. you know? Guess you're right. Someone is pulling with their Sonny strings. running things. That's from the movie. Yeah, with Sonny in charge, this war ain't gonna end in... Okay. Oh, look, it's Clemenza. You ain't seen the last of me, kid, you know that? I got my eye on you. You ain't seen the last of me, kid, you know that? I, oh, I don't know what that's about there, okay. Sonny's War. Sonny takes the war to the streets, aggressively expanding the empire. A terror on the streets. Sonny must also take care of the family at home. Sonny Corleone, Don Vito's brutal heir apparent. Oh. Come on, Sonny. We gotta ease up. Negotiate. You see? There. You see? That's where this Irish crap comes out in you. You know, ease up, take it easy shit. I mean, no disrespect, Tom, but an Italian consigliere would only listen to this negotiation shit if he had a sharp knife held on this guy's throat. Sonny, you're my brother, but sometimes... Oh, Christ, Tom, I'm, I'm sorry. Look, you, you know you're my brother ever since the day I bought you home. But let's face facts here. There's killing to be done. They, um, uh... 
I think that both of them are right. I think that both Tom Hagen and um, uh, Sonny are right in a way where Tom Hagen is way too, you know, much into negotiation. He's too passive, as you guys have told me in the comments, and um, Sonny is too aggressive. I think there's a mix of both, you know, is the correct answer, which Michael takes later on, where uh, you, you negotiate from a position of strength, not negotiate because you just want to negotiate to make things peaceful. Um, Sonny's got some work for you with the Cuneo family. The Cuneos are two of our guys right as they were having a nice meal. These fucking animals. They hit them before they even had their soup. What's the plan? We're gonna hit this bar and the Cuneos got... We're gonna drive by and we're gonna shoot the place up real good. Barabi. Then we're gonna have ourselves a nice little bonfire. So this is the Five Families War. The, um, uh, the Five Families War, this, um, uh... All right, come on, let's get this. my bodyguard boss? getting in. This life, you know, our life. Good. You're not gonna get any medals. They just put you in a river, God knows where. Anyway, this is not a hero business, kid. You don't shoot people from a mile away. You shoot them when you see their pimples or something. I mean, close, you know. You got to stand right next to them, blow their heads off. Sometimes their brains they spill all over your suit. Now. How about that, kid? Uh, how you like that? What's the plan? The plan? You want to know the plan? Here's the fucking plan. Find out who's supplying the joint and then burn it to the fucking ground. That's my fucking plan. They hit us. We hit them back. So this is the Five Families War. In the movie, they talk about how Sonny was waging war against the other families, but it's not really covered that much in the movie, just mentioned. Um, in the game, we actually see Sonny's war against the other families, but it's kind of weird, considering Sonny is technically the Don right now, or I, I should say he's acting boss. Acting boss is when the, when the boss is incapacitated, or the boss is in jail, or boss is out of town. You have an acting boss, and so Sonny's acting boss, but, but and he's taking a soldier with him, it's Aldo, no hey, more backup. That's a help. bit weird, but it's for, you know, you know, video game logic here. Um... Okay, we're here. Time to use the ah. Dillinger. Okay. Get out of here. You wanna lead this charge or what? Is that press too tight? Look at how this Come thing on. just destroys the Cuneos. The Cuneos are the second strongest gang in the game, and this thing is just annihilating them right now. We're gonna knock your teeth. I mean, look at this this thing. The Dillinger is just destroying them right now. Oh, well, here we go. I'm taking a breather, boss. Come back when you need me. Yeah, uh, what is what is this place? Oh, this is a this is a counterfeit cash business. Yeah, they're printing fake bills down here. Who's supplying this joint? The warehouse. It's run by Cuneo. That's all I know. Oh, now this cuts scene. This is you piece of shit. Think you can muscle in on my racket? Fuck you! <laughs> I just love that accent. You, you think you can muscle in on my racket? Like, <laughs> oh man, I, I, I just, I love that, that accent. I try to do it, but it's um. That guy's crazy. Okay, let's blow up that safe then. Okay, only three hundred ninety-five dollars. Oh, this guy got caught in the blast. Oops. Okay. Okay, let's get back up top. Someone! Help. Run, come on, come on! Oh! Get me out of here! I like how he was nice enough to wait for us to get in the car to chase him. Okay. Take this. My bodyguard's also shooting. Okay. Yeah. Got a lot of Cuneos after us now. Let's see if you're bullet.
Whoa! Back up, back up. Okay. There's one of those cars taken down. I'd kill you. I'd kill you. Come on, get rid of them. Ah. Okay, it's gonna have to gonna, going to have to make a left down here. Where do you think you're going? Die, you bastard! Whoa. Okay. Okay, the racket boss should be here. These Corleones don't know when to- uh, uh, uh. Wait. I'm a businessman is all. I don't want no more trouble. You should have thought of that before you set your goons on us. Yep. I'll tell you what you want to know. We, we get supply from Midtown. Midtown, they're in charge. Who's in charge here? You got General Patton selling your tanks? Well, you're not far wrong. Guns. Lots of guns. Hell's Kitchen, an old wharf. Holy hallelujah. Christmas. There's more. Artie Manzarano. He, he's your pope down there. Whoa, look at this. Big time Artie the Moose Manzarano. Hey, that's bingo for us, fellas. Didn't you always pulling some cuneo strings? So now you let me go, huh? It's business. Only business. Oh, sure, sure. You're absolutely right. Time to get out of the business, my friend. Please. Please. I have children. Little children. Everybody loses something. Oh. Yeah, um, uh, so now you have the choice. You can either spare him or kill him, but I always spared the guy, um, uh, ah, they got me, boss! Besides that, 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 um, accent made me laugh. <laughs> but, um, yeah, it's, um, uh, this is, this Ready is the thing, die? is... These, these guys get caught up in the Mafia, they join the Mafia, and then, you know, they say things like that. It's like, you know, you're living a dangerous here, life. Boss. Don't let things get out of hand. Got money on this rooftop, always remember that, but... You know, why are you in the Mafia if you're, you know, talk, talking about your family that much? You gonna pull the trigger or what? And honestly, like, um, I don't know why anybody would ever want to live a life like this. It's basically just for sociopaths. Now, come on, let's find a fat man. Make him an offer. Don't leave without me, boss! You getting in? Okay, I guess he's just sitting there then. But just constant paranoia looking over your shoulder. It's either either people people in the mafia either they get um uh they die young, get killed by somebody, or they get arrested. It's almost either one of the two. They never live long age. And that's that's not even mentioning all the horrible things they do. A lot of these guys they have no conscience whatsoever. You know, they wear a cross, they go to church, um, uh, but then they do these horrible acts. And they just think that it's okay. You know, I I just never understood it. Okay, here we go. Cuneo's warehouse. Well, they give you plenty of time to get here. Um, oh, this warehouse was never on the um. Uh, yeah, you couldn't take it over in the you know when you're outside Let's of mission. Let's find a boss so of this nickel operation. I can't get a good shot. Doing really good with this Dillinger, and this is—I I believe that this gun is the early prototype model of the Thompson. It's kind of weird considering the other—the Tommy gun that we use is actually the later model. Um, but this is the—I um, 
this is like the first prototype version of it. It doesn't even have a stock, really, when you look at it. And the Thompson, this is a pretty powerful submachine gun. This thing fires the 45 um, cartridge, I believe, too. Oh. I can't get a good shot. Wow, look at all this ammo here. Well, I'll be here if you need me, okay? Call him out like a pig that he is. Leave now before I... Adi, can you risk the Corleones as your enemies? Do your business with us, and we'll consider it an act of friendship. Refuse. Then it's an act of betrayal. I built this from nothing. This is my business. Wrong answer. Ugh. Enough. I'll deal. Now that you know I'm serious, Artie, let's talk about a deal. Okay, it's yours. I just hope you know what you're getting into. All right, another day, another dollar and a half. We gotta follow the river, see? You follow the shit upstream to where it's coming from. Stepped in plenty of shit today, boss. No, I'm glad you're on my side. I learned from the best. So there we go. That is the that is the five families war right there. That was um uh the war that Sonny raged against the um uh that he raged against the um uh the Cuneo family, but it was again war against all the families. No way. A traitor in our family? That's what they're saying. Okay. But are they saying who? Not yet. But somebody must have tipped off the Cuneo's racket boss. They knew we were coming for sure. If there is a rat in the family, I'll bet it's Willy Sichi. I don't trust that guy. Oh, that's... You know, the the, the thing is, so there's a, a, a rat in the family. Somebody's giving the Cuneos information. Um, so rat, as in they're helping the other families, that can technically also be classified as a rat. But, you know, this guy's an associate right here, and this guy just basically badmouthed the soldier, Willy Sichi. So if you're going to say something like that, you have to have proof, because that can be really bad right there. So an associate insulting a made man like that. No, I ain't the trade. What do you think, I'm lying? If there is a rat, in yeah, that that's just that is not good. There, um, the streets are clean for now. I might have something for you later. And hey, if you ever need to find me again, I'll be at my girl's place in Jersey. You and Sonny take this whole place down yourselves, man. That's something. Sonny's gone ahead. Meet him back at the compound. Oh. Look, I got nothing for you. Come back later, all right? And hey, if you ever need to find me again, I'll be at my girl's place in Jersey. Okay, so I guess we can unlock hits from Rocco. Um, I guess with that. Come back later. I don't have any work for you. And hey, if you ever need to find me again, Okay, so I guess we'll wrap it up here. It's a good part to end. Thank you guys for watching. I hope that you guys enjoyed it. Oh, no. Why are you guys gonna interrupt me here? Come on. Nailed him. Ah. Okay, now that some, um, uh, that, that, that Kunio hit squad is dead. So, um, thank you guys for watching. I hope that you guys enjoyed this. I'll have the next part up for you guys as soon as I can. Take care, everyone. Thank you.